Yo, what's going on, guys? Stop again here. Lego number 80, I'm pretty sure. And um, so yeah, so today I got three Bricklink packages um, to show you guys. Um, over the last couple days, I've gotten some in. Then also a kind of very cool set that I rebuilt over the last couple days. Um, but anyway, let's get into the Bricklink orders, I guess. Um, the first one is from Bricks on the Dollar. And so I got 50 of the Dark Tan 2x4s. I got 35 of the Dark Orange 2x4s. Now here's the swag bag. It looks like there is a Chima card in there. Maybe two of them. So I guess that's kind of cool. Even though I still have like 50, maybe 50 or 60 from the uh, the Chima sets I've parted out. So not really a need. But um, then right here, the main part. Um, they're not actually used, or at least I'm pretty sure they were listed as new. Um, but I got 400 of the reddish brown at 2x4 plates. Um, and actually, as of now. I honestly don't even need really any of these parts, or at least not the quantities I got. So, that's like 500 at 2x4 plates right there. Um, the next one is from Brick Chick once again. Um, I made a ton of orders from uh, their store in the last couple months. And um, yeah, so basically right here we have... I'm not going to open up these bags actually because I just want to store them in here. Because once again, I don't actually need these right now at all. Um, but I guess it's good to have in my collection. But um, I got a thousand more uh, dark blue gray 4x4. As you guys can tell, they're both still full. I mean, I'm just guessing, you know, 500, 500. Um, but once again, uh, super great deal, I guess. I got them only for $50, and then the shipping was 17 I want to say. Um, then moving on to the last one, um, you know, obviously, you know, the best brick, the best kind of piece out there is a filler brick. And I don't really know what this is. It's a thank you bag, I guess. I got two trans dark blue studs and a purple stud. Uh, so I guess that's thankful. Um, but anyway, so the, yeah, just a ton of filler brick in here. Like 2x2, two two, some with uh, the pinholes. 2x4 with that little uh, print right there. Right here I've got a ton of 2x6s, 2x2 uh, two two with the pin on the side. And then um, a full bag of yellow. I think that's like 800, and then I think I got like 600 of the blue. Um, so all together, I'm pretty sure this is 1,700 more pieces. Um, I got it for like, I think $35 or something like that. Um, so there we go. That's the three orders. And then let's uh, just show you the um, set I rebuilt, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, it is the 2010 AT-AT, or ADAT, uh, Walker. Um, there's only, uh, well, three pieces missing, I guess, um, but I just replaced two of them. I'm missing one shovel right there that I know I have a ton of um, in my collection, but I just don't have it. Um, that's what it's supposed to look like on that side. Um, the top opens and all that. Kind of a fragile head, actually, so I'm probably not going to do that. Uh, this neck is pretty cool. Uh, but once again, this is kind of, it's not, it's sturdy, but it's not like you can't really do too much with it um, without like holding it or something. Um, up here we've got some more um, panels that open. On the side, I wish maybe all this opened. Um, I don't have the minifigures though. Or I, I do, but just not up here. Um, other than that, yeah, very cool set. These are the other uh, pieces I'm missing back here. Um, it's that light bluish gray. Um, six by eights, and I didn't have any in my collection, uh, so I just used uh, dark bluish gray, which honestly I think probably even looks a little bit better. It just kind of adds a little bit more um, to it. And then obviously, you know, sometime soon I'll be doing my uh, kind of uh, like modifying, I guess. Um, I might maybe put like tiles up here, get some places around it, might just, you know, make it smooth, make it a little bit more sleek because the head. I don't really like these right here unless they're supposed to look at like ears. Um, but yeah, so that's basically all guys um, for this Lego haul. I rebuilt this uh, ATAC right here. I'm um, basically 100% complete. In the five orders I placed today though, I did get a shovel from someone. And um, so I can easily just put that on uh, next week during spring break actually. Um, I don't know when you guys are going to be seeing this. Probably Sunday night. Uh, this, that's when I'm recording this. Um, I still have like two or three other hauls to post from like the last week. Um, but just a little recap, filler brick, plates I don't need, more plates I don't need, and a 
at Ed Walker. So thank you guys all for 1,572 subscribers, I think it is. Um, and I probably will have um, a, few, a few of you guys might have saw you know, my subs kind of change back and forth. And I contacted YouTube about it. And I will basically probably make a life vlog about that or something. Um, something major is just like there's a glitch or whatever. Um, because like the amount of subs I did gain within like the day or two for like my size of my channel. Like it wasn't normal I guess or something. And then like it glitched and like added more than it was supposed to. And then it basically like they went through, cleaned it all up. And then so right now um, firmly I'm at about 1,570 um, subscribers because they cleaned up the other like 200 or whatever um, that was just like glitched in my account or whatever so that's basically all guys stay tuned for more videos I'm not really sure it probably just hauls you know for the next couple weeks but that's basically all guys stay tuned for more videos and peace out